What's up guys, this is Unrack from Unrack Pictures. Um, you can check out the official website at unrackpictures.eu.tt. Um, in this tutorial I'm about to show you how to get started with Adobe Premiere Pro. I'm using Adobe Premiere Pro 2.0, but the thing I'm about to show you can be found in any version. So, let's get started. First, you need to choose your type of project. You need to experiment a bit yourself, uh, but I recommend to take a standard TV and the SC 48Hz or a widescreen 48Hz. Um, I'm, I'm taking a standard 48Hz here. Um, give it a name, so name it test and press OK. OK, this is a program. Um, I'm just going to explain some basics here. I think the rest is easy to experiment yourself. Okay, let's get started. Uh, to import the thing, uh, the important thing sorry, is your project tab. That's right here. Uh, if you like to edit a movie, you have you need to import it right here. You can also uh, drag pictures or sounds or whatever to this project tab here. Um, by right clicking here and say import um, you see you can browse through your PC and let me just add uh, this footage here as you see it's a little video clip so let me say open and as you see it's added to my uh, project here you can see it right here um, now still in your project tab here you have a very interesting button which says new item and if you click here, uh, you'll see a little pop-up window will come, a little menu, and uh, if you click on an action right here, it will add to your project. So things like making a title, add a color mat, uh, more, that's right here. So I see add a title, add a color mat, black video, or whatever. <laughs> okay, just experiment a bit yourself. Uh, now the effect step. Uh, where is it? Right here. This is the effect step. Um, here you're able to, brow to browse through your uh, effects in Premiere Pro. The effects to add on audio or on video and stuff. Uh, for example, video effects will give an effect on your whole clip. And video transitions will give an effect on the and or beginning of your clip, like a fade out and stuff. Okay, so like you see, uh, video effects and video transitions here. Um, now the timeline. It's right here. Here you see your video in the timeline, ready to be edited right here. To add the video to this timeline, you just need to drag it from your project to the timeline. Let me just do that. So you just. I'm just uh, going to drag my footage to it, so you drag to it, and as you see, bang, this is your video. Just going to enlarge it a bit. Okay, uh, and as you can see, is a, if I play this uh, video in my program tab here, this is my program tab, and I play it, you will see the video is playing. Okay. <laughs> Um, to zoom in in this, uh, like I did before, is to click on this mouse here, or to drag with this little arrow. Okay. Um. Okay. Now, boo -boo -boo effects. If you want to add an effect to your video, like I told you, you go to effects, video effects. Here you can browse through your effects, right? And you just take an effect. Okay. I'm just gonna take some. Standard. Um, still, on the, still on the maps now. These are the effects. Let's take brightness and contrast. And if you drag this to your um, footage, so you just drag it like it, and you just leave your right left button here. Um, you will see that the effect will pop up in your effect control tab. That's right here. Now, to adjust this effect, we open the effect. That's the arrow right here. And we'll see some options will appear. Okay. Now, if we increase the brightness, for example, 
you will see that in our program the brightness will increase. Okay, now this is for the whole clip. Okay, so if I go back to my timeline here and I go through my timeline, you see that I, that I just to my whole clip, everything is a bit brighter. Okay, back to my effect control. Um, let me see. Beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah. Um, this here, or work set. This is something important too. Um, what is this? You have or your arrow here. This is just to work like uh, doing stuff like adjusting uh, an effect and stuff. Um, but some some basic, some really important thing here is your razor tool. This is to cut into your clip. So if you say I don't want the brightness everywhere on my clip, I just want it only on this side, uh, you can just cut right here and then you back go back and take your arrow okay and then you just uh, select this clip and you go to your effect control now as you see this effect is on that thing but if you press delete or you press right click and you say cut or whatever then it will disappear and if you go I'm just gonna go back in time you will see that the first clip has the effect on the second clip doesn't have this effect. Okay, this was it. Um, for those who still don't know what this program is, by the way, it's a video editing program. Okay. Um, so this here gives you a little idea what Adobe Premiere Pro is all about. Uh, um, to learn more about this uh, program, you can always check our official webs website and watch the second tutorial I made. It's about making titles and how to work with uh, the effect control, basically. Um, this was Unrec from Unrec Pictures, and I hope you learned something. Thank you very much for watching.